Yo, what's up, guys? It is John D. Pro here, and welcome back to another YouTube video. And today it is, you guessed it, Christmas. It is December 25th, 2021, aka Christmas Day. And today, um, uh, we're actually starting to wrap up the year. So, because we're starting to wrap up the year, I'm actually going to make a YouTube video of all of the Lego sets I have, including one that I got for Christmas. But just before I begin, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and tap that notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload YouTube videos. And without further ado, let's go ahead and begin. So our first up is the Lego Space Shuttle, which is very cool. If you just open this right here, there's a driver inside. And if you open this thing up, this is where it gets interesting. So you have that little thing, you got like a little golden thing, and then you have like the space helmet. I don't know what these are called, but let me know in the comments below what it is. So that's basically the Lego Space Shuttle. Extremely cool. And then right here, these are my three animals I got. I got myself a crocodile, a bear, and I also got myself a shark with a big long nose. So those animals actually look really cool. And yeah. Next up, we got the yacht. So, the yacht's basically an uh, extremely cool boat. So, we got two diving uh, helmets. We got four flippers, two for each person. We got the driver back here, and we got another woman who's eating a slice of a watermelon and also a soda. And yeah, it's gonna be fun. Right here, we have the accessories as well. We got a green camera, we got a I'd say like a little recording video, a blue fish. Now this area here, this is what they're looking for. So basically this right here is um, uh, the thing they're looking for. There's a crab. I, I decided to put the jewel in his hand to know that he's just taking, taking like the um, uh, thing. And then inside is, I put a jewel in there and also put a gold bar in there to make it look cool. And uh, that's that. And then right here is the flag. And the, this flag right here in the water is the symbol to know that uh, you're right under there. And now next up is the Coast Guard plane set. So this right here is the Coast Guard plane. You can see uh, that there's a driver inside. And then in the back right here, um, uh, if you just open this up, open this little leverage right here, um, uh, there is a jet ski inside of here. Here, let me take it out real quick. There we go. There's the jet ski. Jet ski number two. And what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to go after this guy right here who was in the storm and was trapped. And he was si signal signaling for help. And this Coast Guard plane just took off, landed in the water, grabbed on the jet ski, rescued the man, put the jet ski back in there, and flew off. So that's basically what it is. And um, uh, it'll be very uh, fun for you guys to play as. Luckily, this guy here, I'm um, gonna uh, get some help. All right. Next up, right here, we have I have my two Lego race cars. I got number two right here, um, uh, the DMG Mori, a poor whatever how you pronounce it. This race car number two, and then on the other side right here. This is my other Lego car, this Octan number one. And then right here, I put two assistants with two tools and then also have a trophy. It's silver, but I wrote first place on it to know that's the first place trophy. And then right here, we have, I actually have two Lego pieces. And these are used if you accidentally put a Lego piece in the wrong spot or it's hard to take it off. You can use these two tools by doing a bunch of stuff. Like you can make them like into Lego sets like these. But another thing is you can like scoop it up or you can like put the Lego piece right there, right here, and then you can scrape it out. That's how you can do it. Yeah. So basically, if you have a hard time getting Legos out, then um, uh, you should get this tool. It'll be available in Lego sets. Right here, we have the little road work. So basically, there's this guy right here and he basically just like scoops up the road and like fills it when it like has a hole or a crater. This right here is like a sign of warning drivers that there's road work ahead. Two cones. There's like a, actually a little rat or a mouse, which I actually kind of like. It reminds me of Jerry from Tom and Jerry, that clever rat. We got a, um, a wheelbarrow with cement in it. And then we got its uh, 
road work truck with some more supplies. And then right here, these, um, if you guys ever seen the movie Lego Movie, you have like Emmett and Wild Style, aka Lucy. And basically I have these figures from a um, uh, Lego Movie set. I also have myself this like little rope thing because it's kind of fun because right here, which is my police station, also have the Lego figure Bad Cop. So what I like to do is I like to put the robe here and then like Bad Cop is like looking down. He's like, what are you doing? He looks like about to shoot him. If you seen in the Lego movie, like Bad Cop shoots his gun and then there's like a little detective device that goes on Emmett's little, um, uh, I'd say Lego legs right here. And it basically just alerts, I think it alerts him like where he is. And also gives him like where he is. And then right here, I also have this little Star Wars thing, R2-D2. I really love that one. And now we're starting to get into the police set. So this right here is a little police jet ski or water scooter. It's actually very cool for any criminal who's on the loose in the water. And then right here, this is my Lego police transporter. And this is how um, uh, uh, prisoners get transferred to this Lego prison right here. And what's really cool about this is, is that this can open up in three ways. It can open up like this. And inside is like a guy like telling like what the criminals are. And there's also a little dog. And then this part right here, there's like a motorcycle inside. And then also you can lift this down to let it go. It's just a uh, very awesome. And there's also an escape thing. So basically there's this little driver right here. He has a hook connected to the jail right now. But if you like connect it to here with this little hook, if you pull it off too hard, then it can actually knock this off, which it, which can let the prisoner free and can basically just put it back. So it's it's actually pretty cool. And I suggest you probably get this set. And now it's time for one of my favorite sets, the big Lego police helicopter. So basically right here, we have the most famous, one of the most famous Lego characters of all time, Chase McCain right here. Here's a look at the helicopter. It's really awesome. There's a, a helicopter pile inside. So basically what happens is if you like this black thing uh, right here, if you twirl it, it can drop him down and back up. And basically this guy in the red car right here as you're looking at, so basically he like, has to drop down and like grab him and stuff. And it's actually kind of cool. And if you actually want to try it, you see this like little like thing like here. Uh, let me give you a demonstration. Hold on for a second, folks. All right. Let me just remove that for a second. All right. So basically what happens is like, like pretend Chase McCain's right by here and he's like, you're going to arrest, but he's like, no, I'm not. And then like the helicopter swoops by and um, uh, with this hook, he can actually like hook you up. Hold on for a sec. It can hook you, and if it's really secure, it can take you right up in the air. So that's actually pretty cool and stuff. That's awesome. That's really awesome. That's one way, that's one cool way to catch a bad guy. So it would be very awesome if you got the set as well. And now it's time for the Lego police station, ladies and gentlemen. So right here we have uh, this guy and this girl and this guy is trying to break him out. He's putting dynamite in there. And what happens is if you push this yellow button, um, uh, it will actually like explode the jail and let him free. Like watch this. You gotta push it a little hard to get it out, but watch this. Kaboom! The thing falls and then basically the prisoner can get out. All right. And in order to reset it, you just switch this right here. And then you just basically put it back on. All right, prisoner, get back in there. That's where you belong. There you go. All right, and then you can like, if you want to, you can make your own creation. Like you can make another trap right here. But if you like try to pull this Lego thing off, it basically won't work because it's on the outside. But basically, if you want to, you can like make more traps in like a Lego prison. It's like pretty awesome. And now let's check the inside. First off the jail. So right here we have the little uh, prison. We got ourselves a toilet, um, a drawing with escape plans and tic-tac-toes and days they've been in there. And then these are the beds. But one cool thing about it is if you lift it up like this, there are crowbars inside that can um, uh, actually escape. 
But another thing is there are prisoners on this other floor right here. And uh, real quickly, um, uh, there's actually this little thing. I like to use it as a weight because sometimes prisoners work out in prison. So that way they can get strong or get some energy. So basically, they have no escape on the first floor. But on the second floor, it's obvious. So um, uh, basically, this little gray thing right here, you just want to like lift it up. I'm using under. Real quick, hold on for a sec. And then um, uh, basically what you want to do is put the crowbar under. Oh, here, hold on, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so just like that, and some prisoners could come up and he could escape on the second floor. But of course, you're not gonna escape, so I will put this back on and no more crowbar. <laughs> All right, and now let's go to the inside of the police station. Well, real quickly, let's let's check out a bit of a, a bit of the outside. So, right here, we have like this police gate that can let out police cars. We have a police car right there. And what's cool about this police car right here, let me move these out of the way. These are basically all my other vehicles, like motorcycles, ATVs, yes, and stuff. So basically, a really cool thing is you lift this up, and there's actually a police car in there. But another cool thing is, this right here is actually a launcher, this thing right here. And if you press it, like, really hard enough, it'll, like, spew out. Like, watch this. Let me step back. All right, watch this. Look how cool that was. It's awesome. Very awesome. So basically right here, this is probably like, this is probably like the boss's office. I, I don't, I'm pretty sure. Probably, probably just a normal office. And basically that's where it is. There's basically another office right here with coffee. And there's also a coffee maker. There's like a water, I'd say like a bit of a water fountain or a water refilling. And another office there. And then that's where like the criminals take their picture and stuff. And then right here we have a canine. And I also like to like put a police guard right next to the door. And he also has a gold key that lets him in and out, which is pretty cool. And then this right here, um, uh, that that's the camera right there. And then this guy, um, uh, he's like the boss of the police station. And I'm pretty sure he's just like doing whatever cops do every single day. And yeah, that's basically the police station. And up here, we actually have the police helicopter. It's a pretty small helicopter. The helicopter right there can fit on there, but um, uh, it's good to have two amazing helicopters. And now we're going to go on to the fire station. All right, let's move these out of the way. All right. So right here we have uh, the Lego fire station that I got for my birthday last year, my 14th birthday. My 15th birthday is actually coming up. So um, I, yeah, so. Right here we have a little fire symbol. We got ourselves like, I'd say this like little woman who um uh, like just swirls around. And he also, I think she's also supposed to look out for fire and um, uh, also report the fire like this one right here where we'll get to in a few minutes. And then this right here, these are basically just two couples watching a firefighter show, eating my um, uh, popcorn and drinking some uh, drinks right here. Awesome. And then that right there is the boss with the gold helmet on. And then basically there's a phone right next to him with a clock. And then this is like one of my favorite dogs of all time. It's like a Dalmatian dog. It's like a white dog with black spots. And there's also a um, uh, fire jet ski, which is real cool. And there's also a fire motorcycle. And also real quickly, if you guys are actually wondering if like the scooter or boat floats, look at like the bottom of the box and it'll tell you if it floats or not. If it says do not float, uh, believe them because it will sink if you ever try to play with them in the bathtub So this right here, it's like our one fire truck or fire car, whatever And this right here, this is actually where the drone used to be that little fire drone that flies But I like to replace it with a helicopter because it actually makes sense then Since that the police station has a helicopter and our hospital which we're gonna get to next has a helicopter So basically I just like to add it like that and so yeah, that's the fire station. Right here, we got uh, tools like an ax and stuff. That's the same thing over here to the police station. And now we're gonna check out the bus stop. So this right here is the bus stop. So basically you have these uh, three people getting on the bus. And now this Lego bus is awesome. It can hold 
bikes in the back and there's like a whole bunch of stuff and it even has stuff on the door it has like this transportation which enters and then anyone that has like a stroller or is in like a wheel cart sits here and then inside also says 242 brick uh, square via center city the bus